Uh huh. All right. Wait, I'm adjusting stuff. There we go. Uh huh. All right. Uh, nightmare mode, I guess. Can, can you do? Uh, no, I don't think I still have the safe, right? Nightmare mode. This is where set star z zero point four. You remember how to get yourself around, right? Actually, no. <laughs> it can hurt to have a refresher. You have an assortment of abilities: Z to attack, X to dash, uh, A to special attack, and C or escape to open your inventory. Oh, this is the new tutorial section. Yes, the developer did mention that there will be a tutorial to the game. Z attack, X dash, A special attack. All right. C or escape to open inventory. It will be better, I think, if it's to open inventory is S because Z, X, and S are close to each other. But all right. You can hold the tech button down to charge it. This charge can be kept with various methods. The same button as well as the button can be used to interact with objects. The start that has the muted charge attack. Ah, that's a charge attack. Oh, well, I forget that you can dash. <laughs> wow. C is to pause. I don't understand why C is faster. No, cannot get out. Wait, oh, okay, there's a wall. That bunny is cute, though. Wait, is the duck? No, just, just, just my feeling. I'm pretty sure the duck changed position. Just my feeling, now? Okay, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm slowly going insane because of this kind of game. Nice work. You can dash through attacks to avoid taking damage. This as well as special attacks can use up your stamina, so manage it carefully. Try dashing through that projectile. Okay, wait, wait. I'm trying to understand stuff become because I'm stupid. Okay, there's an attack there. Wow. There are numbers of items you can use as well. Press down at the item to pick it up, then press up to store it in your infantry. All right. Who is this? Hello. Do you want a cake? Yum 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 yum. Press it to eat. I can eat it. What happened if I eat it? Oh, I cannot eat it. Alright. Up, store. You take a bit of damage, you should use the item to restore your health. Uh, Alright. Press yes or C. Okay, Z to take item. A button can also be used to use some items instantly. Fascinating. This can be useful for acting quickly in battle. Wait, let me try that A thing. How do I pick? Store A. That covers the basic of combat. There are other abilities, but you'll remember them as you go. Okay. Combat's basic are important, but searching for clues and secret is half the battle. Oh, oh interesting. This world has been torn apart by a part by, by an unknown force. Use your intuition and you will end up even more powerful than before. If any challenge seems too difficult, experiment and you will come out on top. There's only so much a human can do with Brown alone. Whenever you're ready to wake up, exit out the door with a button. Sure. Bye! Oh, this door. By the way, the developer also mentioned that they added three or two new bosses, two or three new NPCs, tutorial, and a... A visitor? What does a visitor mean? I'm, I'm kinda scared. <laughs> well, yes, anyway, let's get out. Oh yes, the basic of the game, the starting stuff. This is how we enter the demon realm back then? Yes. Ah. Fascinating. Do uh, Nope, I doesn't have access to any of that stuff. What is this? Okay, that is very unsettling, but I bet those are the two new bosses. I thought there was three. Am I... Perhaps I misread. It's been a while since we got here, hasn't it? I say it's got here, but our house looked relatively the same. Are we still in the same places we knew, or did it move somewhere? Nothing outside is familiar at all as far as I can see. Seems to be some living things out there, but I'm not sure if I can trust anything. There are so many things I'd like to know, but there aren't enough answers. Yep, totally. Ah, uh, whatever, I better get going. I might be crazy, but I almost don't want things to return to normal. I wasn't anything special prior to this, and I'm still not. But it feels like I have a chance to change that here. Maybe that's why I feel such a strong push to go and explore. 
In a way, this almost feels like some sort of trial to prove myself. <laughs> wow. I'm probably going crazy. Yep, you are. Let's try again. Everything around here feels like it can change on a whim. It's as if the world is currently being built as we know it. That will explain how hastily to put together it feels. But maybe it's supposed to be that way. There's a lot of scary things out there and Beryl refused to leave the house because of that. Thankfully, some of my seemingly useless skills I learned seem to be paying off now, though. Whenever I have to confront one of those things, I just try to keep myself calm and I tend to get through it. It's the only thing I really have going against this new world. And the monsters, I can't even make out what they look like, but I just have to keep fighting. Or else I'll... I don't, rem I don't remember reading the dialogue back then because... I'm kinda stupid and assume it's the same dialogue. Beryl's been pretty sad lately and I don't feel like I can do much about it, especially with our conflicting interests. She wants to stay home, but I can tell it's kind of wearing down on her. Ah, it's such a frustrating situation. The least I can do is try to talk to her more like she asked, though. Thinking back, I didn't do anything super interesting. I just studied for school, occasionally meet friends, watch some shows. Um, I could try stargazing tonight, but the sky is rarely ever clear enough. I want to watch TV, but well, I might need to get another one. Yeah, the TV is kind of... <laughs> Kinda of acting strange, if you know what I mean. Not sure if there's any even even any cable around here anyway, so what's the point? What can I do for fun? I think the most terrifying thing about this place is its ability con to constantly make me dope things. Exactly, I, I doped that duck painting back then. The monsters are one thing, but the fact I can tell the difference between fantasy and reality is concerning. I suspected it was just world messing with me, but I really don't know for sure. The first thing I need to figure out is the point of those odd totem things. Or totem? Whenever I get in a bad situation, I end up back at whatever totem I touch, as if it's protecting me. Oh, the save point. But can I really trust them? They don't look friendly in the least. On top of that, Beryl hasn't even acknowledged the one here. It's like she can't even see it. Oh, very interesting. Why? All of this make me think about how little power I actually have. It all just feels so hopeless. My main chance of surviving is using something that I know might or might not come back to bite me. I... I can't even tell myself that the thing I'm fighting are monsters or not. There's no point in trying to figure this out. It's all I have and thus I'll use it. Even if it means I may be sacrificing something, I'll cling onto it. Fascinating. There's been some beautiful looking places I like to go back to sometime, but I forgot how to get to them again. I kind of have a poor mental map of everything here, and that's definitely gonna be a problem. Mm, nope, it's not gonna be a problem for me, because I remember stuff here. Exactly how it is, or maybe not. It's easy to get distracted here, though, so it can be helped anyways. Speaking of which, there's a lot of secrets, if I can call them that. I'm normally not good at finding those kind of things, but they're everywhere on here. I could touch a totally normal object and it will send me to a completely new place. It's mind-boggling. Any new dialogue? I'm happy my room has been relatively untouched since the incident, otherwise I wouldn't be able to just sit and think. A lot of dialogues I haven't noticed before. It's good for me after looking around aimlessly for a while just to remind myself of the bigger picture. Anyways, I'm gonna need some items to analyze. That's at least something I'm decent at, which is guessing I use for most things I see. Hopefully at least one of them will be a clue on what I can try and do next. Oh! Yes, that is interesting. I may be crazy, but I almost don't want things to return to a normal. I wasn't anything special prior to this, and I'm still not. But it feels like I have a chance to change that here. Maybe that's why I feel such a strong push to go and explore. In a way... <coughs> sorry. <coughs> In a way, this almost feels like some sort of trial to prove myself. I'm probably going crazy. Is this? Yeah, it is. Wait, it is? Yep, 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 it is the same dialogue. Finally, we can continue. I'm interested to explore. Let's save first before doing anything. Uh, yeah, save before talking to burial or anything. Good morning, little brother. Morning. Going out again? Yep. Any plans this time? Nope. You know, at this point you have probably seen everything you could. It's better to just stay home and or oh, talk to you more. <laughs> I can. What else are we going to do here? Mm-hmm. Come on. 
I still disagree, but as long as you can come home safely, I guess it's fine. Sorry, I'm... My throat is kind of... Can I feel bad? Feel? However, I want one thing in return for your stubbornness. Huh? What is it? Talk to me more. Why? I'm bored. <laughs> Alright, come with me when I go then. Nah. Mm hmm Come on. No, don't mock me. Okay, fine, I'll chat more. Finally, you're making sense. Yeah. The house has been really odd ever since the incident. Some parts of it seems to be alive, regenerating whenever you take them out of their intended spot. On that note, there's a piece of cake. Yeah, I already know that. I've read this dialogue a long time ago. <laughs> that doesn't like a, sound like a problem to me. It's free food. Sure, but it isn't, isn't it basically a living organism now? I guess, I don't know. I eat it. <laughs> <laughs> You're gross. Yeah, MC, do you know why the house feels so floaty recently? Because we are in the middle of a void. I'm not really sure, but it seems to be in some kind of void now. <laughs> yes. Huh? Haven't you looked out the window? All I see are creepy things out there, so I just avoided it. Yeah, those. It seems like they are keeping the house afloat. I don't like them. We don't have any curtains for this window, so... Can you grab some while you're out? Oh! We can do that? When... MC, when do you think mom and dad will return? I have no idea. I haven't found interest over them. Ah. Burial, you don't think... Don't worry, I'm sure they'll be back in no time. Oh no, the flag. Our family is practically built to survive. I'll try to keep looking for them. I mean, yeah, MC survived for a long time already. I've been thinking about picking up some kind of hobby. Because all I did since we got here was sleep and eat. I mean, that's a good hobby. <laughs> oh really? What do you have in mind then? Hmm. Well? Never mind, sleep is good. <laughs> wow. Maybe next time you'll figure something out. How about doing, I don't know, streaming to the people outside there? <laughs> to the void thing? Or maybe become an artist? MC, I just thought of a great idea. Oh no. Oh, uh, okay, tell me. Oh no. I can try talking to some sense into those monsters. Oh wow. <laughs> and then... Hang on, that is still in progress. Wow. What? That's just a sort of an idea. Oh, I should sleep on it first before I expand on this idea. Again, okay, that's not a great idea if you don't have anything. Hey, do you have any other excuses for why you want to stay home again? Isn't it obvious? It's gross out there. Every time you come home, you're covered in something. What? It, it just comes with the job. It's not a job, though. Okay. I'm so hungry, I don't know what to eat. A lot of dialogue. Don't we have a bunch of food left? Yeah, but it's not food food. <laughs> It's like, uh, like, it's like the food are talking breathing. It's hard to eat it. What? What qualifies as food food? You mean easy food? Actually, maybe if I try cooking again. Oh, nice. You know, MC, I haven't tried cooking in a while. Maybe it's time for your big sister to dust off the old spatula. I'll cook. <laughs> Why? <laughs> but you didn't let me finish my thought. Fine, what was it? I was thinking, what if I toasted some bread and some beans and nope, nope, don't. I'll cook. <laughs> hey! MC, do you like how things have turned out? What? Of course not. Why would you even ask that? You did mention to yourself back then. About that. I was just wondering, since I've never seen you like this before, you were always kind of standoffish and never really put a lot of efforts into things. I always gave everything my all, I just... I don't know, I never felt needed before all of this. By the way, oh, let me check my avatar. Hmm, probably it's kind of blocking stuff, so I'm gonna make myself tinier. Ooh, shoot. There we go. Tiny me. Let's continue. Needed? Is there someone you're trying to impress? Not really. I don't even understand it myself. I see it as some kind of rude awakening. You almost seems like a new person sometimes. Really? I hope it doesn't make you uncomfortable or anything. Nah, I think I like it. I thought you could have picked a better time to turn a new leaf. This... I, th I I kind of vaguely remember this dialogue. Not my fault. Little brother, I found something that you might want to look at. I put it in your... Um, side room? Bathroom? I don't know. It's next to your bedroom. Maybe it can help you out. I think you need an X for it. Oh? Fascinating. Beryl, I didn't know you had a change of heart with me exploring. I can change your mind, so I'm just helping you not die. Mm -hmm. X? The house has been really odd ever since the incident. Some parts of it seems to be alive, regenerating whenever you take them out of their- Oh wait. 
Yep, yep, it's the dialogue I have done before. Alright, then let's continue our journey throughout the game. What do you mean? Wait, what? Oh! Oh? X type? What does that mean? I need an X, aren't I? Fascinating. Let's take the cake first. Store? No, I cannot take it more. The piggy bank is still there. I cannot do anything to it. I forgot how to attack Z. I'm stupid. Oh yeah, that place. I don't want to go there. Or maybe I want to go here. Oh, hey, there's a boss here. Should I grab a better weapon first or should I start beating up some boss? How do I grab some more weapon? I forget how, how to do that. Coming through. Oh shit, I forget you're still alive. I don't see you're still alive, not forget. Ah oh, yeah, the boss here. How do I defeat this one again? Wait, I kinda forgot. Ow, oh, what? Fuck, what the fuck was that? Okay, right. No, 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 why? Like, what the fuck was that? No, 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 let me, let me go the fuck back. I don't remember those thing back then in the boss fight. Can I even wound that? Ah, it's just to make the boss fight more... Interesting, so I cannot wound those thing below, that is interesting. How do I avoid you? I cannot forget about that. Oh god, this will be tough. A, li a little bit tough. Ow. Nope, I died. Okay, let's go back there when we have some upgrade ourselves. I could just do this infinitely to this thing and yep get some coin if I can very interesting what's in this direction nothing oh yeah the thing what are you <laughs> I forget what are you oh wait how many of you can we store nope we can only store one uh, we have to check the those later I think yes we can go here why is it red Oh, you! I forget how to deal with you. I don't want to deal with any of you for now. Alright, uh, then I try to deal with you because I'm curious. Ow! Okay, I'm stupid. Am I even dealing damage? The problem is that the damage checks are kind of small and I cannot see stuff. Am I ne Yep. I, I don't think I'm dealing damage. I'm dealing damage. Oh, wait. I, I, do, I do. I do deal damage. Yeah, this mini boss right here is pretty simple because you just need to do this. I still remember a little bit how to fight this thing. I think there's a much more better method, or this is the better method. Ah, but yeah, there's other method if I remember correctly. Whoa, this guy is annoyingly tough with the shield.
There we go. Store. Oh yeah, by the way, this thing's Burns hand, right? I better save a bit before I try to continue doing stuff. Because then that will be good for me. I guess. They respawn. Seriously. No wonder it's a nightmare mode. Okay. I remember there's something here. Yeah, that thing. Whatever you do, don't touch it because it's basically... Invincible? But afraid of this. I think... Oh, it's still here. Alright, we got ourselves a damage up. That's interesting, I better save again because I don't want to lose these stats. And we are just going around to get some damage increase in order to do stuff. We can kill that thing, but in order to do that we need an axe, if I remember correctly. Yeah, an axe. But I'm not sure there's anything that will help in, oh, in dealing, what do you call it? No, 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 I, yes. I, I don't find a word. I don't exactly found anything useful from killing that thing. We have 43 money, by the way. Hi, MC. You. Lucky, how did you... Oh, yeah, I, I've read this. You're chill for us ever. Mm -hmm. Again, what are you doing in... In our front yard? Mm -hmm. Provide my service. What else would I be doing here in our front yard? Oh, you're gonna help us? Nope. Yes, for a price, of course. Uh, don't look at me like that. I need to get by. G get by what? We do too, but we aren't extorting money. Well, I actually got a discount, MC. You're special. Flattering. So, yeah, the potion, the 300. Uh, this still's empty for a long time. I'm kind of curious what that is. Huh. Let's go back for now. Alright, so I got to take a little break back then, but now I'm back here. Return? Oh, wait. Oh yeah, that's the control still doesn't really remember. Why is it suddenly a little bit lagging? No, it's fine, I suppose. Anyway, I changed my microphone settings a little bit also while taking that break and also changed my avatar placement, so there's that. Just telling you now. Anyway, where was I? Oh yeah, the shop and then we are... We are trying to find another upgrade before trying to fight anything here because uh, this is nightmare mode. <laughs> <laughs> and it is hard. So this is lucky. We still have 43 gold. Not enough for anything. They're supposed to be... What the hell? That's new. Is this still the same dialogue? Yep. This is still the same dialogue like the old demo. So I'm not really reading it. Mm -hmm. Yep. That always sounds like the little sister. I don't understand what, what that thing is. Or no, no. The older sister. What is this? I cannot step it, I cannot do anything. Perhaps I could hot type? Nope. Dash through it? Nope. Go down, so I put so That looks very new. No? Uh wait. Oh yeah, there there you go. Oh my god. Uh wait, store it first. You? Well, nothing happened to you, so that's nice to know. Let's beat this one thing up, shall we? I'm not sure I need to beat you up, though, because I already have beaten the other there. But perhaps some secret will be unlocked if I beat you up? Yeah, the key is not to spam, because literally... Ow. There you go, because this guy has a... Better timer for the defense, I noticed back then. The dialogue, the damage dialogue is not really feasible, so that's a problem for me to see whether or not I'm damaging or not. Will this scare you? 
That do scares you, right? Oh, he does. Or maybe not, I'm not sure. Oh, let's show this to Lucky first. I'm kinda curious of directions. That's a peculiar little thing you got there, MC. It seemed interesting enough. Tell me, what does it do? Um, I don't know what it does. In that case, you shall sell it to me. Oh, we can. Nope, you never know what you can do with things around here. Oh, that's a shame. Lame, but we have um, unlimited amount of these things. God damn it. Well, put it down then. How about the cake? Why are you just walking around holding that? Your hands are gonna get dirty, you know. <laughs> I've been holding it in my pocket for a long time. <laughs> yes. Oh, I'll put it in my pocket then. Don't you have a bag, you know, to put the cake in? Nope. Come on, go get something to put it in. Damn, you're dirty, MC. What? I forget something, now I'm back. I have to do something else. Oh, wait. Oh, whoa, whoa, no, where's the cake? God fucking damn it. Oh, well, I can just grab the cake again. Oh, what a cute little doggy. Woof, woof. You're gonna, oh, you're gonna scare it. What? What? I'm great around animals. Look at Luke, you know. <laughs> Grrr. Uh, this happens every time. Oh, no. Look at that. Yeah, look at Luke's face. Oh, you really love the dog. Okay, let's... No, no, no. Take the dog. Bre star store it. Why cannot I store it? Store the dog. Okay, thank you. Now I lost the cake, but I can always take it back. That's the upgrade that I have. I can have multiple upgrades, I think. I'm not sure which place I should go first, because... Are you faster than usual? I think you are. Oh yeah, you can go here too. A customer? I think... Yeah, this is the same old dialogue, so I'm not really reading it. Uh-huh. Southern Air Station. Train Station. Train broke down. Yeah. Oh, you are selling souvenirs. All of your customers will love you. Mm-hmm, you are doing very great, sure. Is she okay? She's okay. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah, they, they, there's still an, not anything much added here, except dialogue, I guess. In this part. And moral support. <laughs> uh-huh, name. MC. MC, okay. What's your name? Call it. Gotcha, call it. Wait, why does that name sound co so convenient? Your name also. <laughs> uh, never mind. I'll see you later, call it. Bye-bye, MC. Okay, let's see. Do you, I've been thinking, do you go anything other than by anything other than MC? Just calling you MC doesn't feel quite right to me. Oh, that's a good point. Um, <laughs> why are you changing? <laughs> don't, don't sweat it, take your time. MC, hi. Despite my issues with my repairing the train, I happen to be great at repairing other things. Oh, like what? Oh? Just about anything. Well, that's pretty good to know. What do you use for your repairs? Why, my wrench, of course. For every broken item. <laughs> yeah, every broken item. Oh, uh, I'm not sure. Sending here is kind of tiring sometimes, I know. I, I'm not sure we can fix all the things then. You don't have any legs, though. How is that an issue? It takes energy to keep floating. I don't have an infinite supply, you know. Oh, okay. Why not just sit down then? Oh, good idea. I can show you what that looks like. Huh? Is there a lengthy process to it or something? Probably. Um, MC, do you know anyone who'd be interested in stuff I have for sale? I, actually, have I talked to L Lucky? I cannot forget now. Perhaps I should talk to Lucky for this. Hmm, the only person I can think of is my sister, Burial. The problem is she doesn't want to leave the house. What? But there are so many good things to see out here, uh, monsters. I... She, sure, she doesn't know what she's missing. Between me and you, I can do more than just fix things. Oh, what else can you do? I can sing. Uh... I can also hold my breath underwater for five minutes. Wow, that's amazing. Wow, that's impressive. Wait, you're a ghost too. Does that even count? <laughs> Before the ghost, probably? No, but being underwater for five minutes is time consuming. I eventually want to come out because I got bored of the challenge. Wait. <laughs> so, as a ghost, you can only do it for five minutes. Oh, I also know some sane language. Hey, <laughs> I have many more skills than you may think, MC. <laughs> Not nice. What are some of your subside hitting things? Oh, um... I, uh... I'll get back to you on that. Oh, oh no. On that one. Hum, is something wrong? Don't worry about it. I got shut down so easily and she didn't even do it on purpose. 
Why did you end up settling down in a place like this? Yeah. Hmm, I felt drawn to it in a way. Drawn. That, that, that's a pun, you know, in a way, I guess, and because you're a train conductor. Something in my mind told me to try learning some new things here. I don't know why it had to be here, but something about it is comforting to me. Oh, I would like would also like to get train working again so I can visit our place safely though. Maybe I'll even let you use it. But anyways, that's been my goal for a while, it just feels right. It helps me forget about the bad things and care for my own path in a way. That's not weird, right? Whatever you're doing seems way cooler. <laughs> Nah, I really respect your choice. You're staying safe, but you're still productive. I thought I was the only one who wanted to try and find myself here, so it's really cool to see someone else do it. I see, that's good. That reminds me, what's your goal exactly? I don't really know for sure, honestly, but I know I deserve something deep inside. I think I invite you, invite you call that. H huh? W why? I've got nothing going on. I got an odd first impression of you, but you seem like you have so much figured out already. Oh, also I don't have that much figured out. You don't have to believe in yourself, but I will. Oh, huh? That's so sweet. I never get to ask, but how old are you? Oh, I don't know. How do you not know your age? I mean, being goes for a long time, you could forget. What about your birthday month? Do you still know those? Um, September 27th? Yeah, I think that's it. Why did you want to know? I'm just curious, maybe it'd give me an idea on how things work around here, and maybe you can give them a cake. Just in case time flows differently than usual or something. Um, are you sure you didn't just want to know my birthday? Hmm. What? <laughs> okay, that wasn't my plan, but... September 27th, don't forget it. Oh. Sh shut up. Any... Uh-huh. Hey MC, what's up? I've been thinking. Do you go by anything... Okay, this is the same dialogue. I can just skip it. Can I go wait? Oh, right then. There's not much anything new in this area. Fascinating. Oh, well, freak. I'm just gonna dash through them because it's much more better for crowd controlling. There we go. Where should we go next? There's th this TV that shows everything, but I want to talk to Colette first. Yeah, relaxing around and collecting gold, you know that. Uh, I lost the keys to my house again. <laughs> oh. Is that why you've been staying here this whole time? <laughs> P partially. In this world, you never know if you'll just see the keys show up where you normally leave them. Have you checked there yet? Huh? No, I guess I'll go check. Thanks, MC. <laughs> Sniff. Jeez, look at you. What happened to your confidence, Demonor? I lost it all with my keys. <laughs> Don't worry, you get this. Hey, MC, you should bring whatever you find to me. That's awfully blonde. Why should I? I can try and inspect it for you. However, everything might come with a fee. I think I'll stick to inspecting items myself. <laughs> oh no, uh, but it's so boring here, just bring me stuff to look at. Fine, I'll do it for free. Oh, nice. That's more like it. Hey Lucky, why are you role-playing as a merchant now? Role-playing? It's not role-play, it's a new way of life. You say that every few months. <laughs> Last time you were a doctor and before that you were a rich person. Ooh, you can just say you're a rich after your first paycheck, by the way. <laughs> Err, uh, you'll see. Speaking of money, I really wish we still had jobs or college or something, or just anything other than this. So, all of you are trapped here. Interesting. I thought Lucky was just some sort of imagination of this world. This is so boring. The whole world got trapped in this limbo. Why is everything boring to you? This is better than having to do any of those things. I miss my friends. I guess that's understandable. Oh yeah, MC, I've been meaning to show you something. Really? What is it? You just need to leave your house first. I've been trying to figure that out the whole time. Everywhere I go looks nothing like the outside of the whole house. <laughs> Try going out your front door again, then you might be surprised. Front door? Which one is the front door? Sure hope so. Interesting, what does it mean? I haven't seen anyone else since everything went down. How come you managed to come out alive and well? Yeah. I don't know, I slipped through whatever happened and woke up feeling fine. <laughs> That's it? How do you get here then? I just walked over from my house. Whoa. Was it really that easy for you? What about all the monsters? I, it wasn't that bad. I snagged past all of them pretty easily. On a more important note. You should come over sometime. I found some cool stuff after everything happened. Oh, how? You're really something else. How has your sister been? She's been doing... Wait, why not come in and talk to her so you can catch up? 
A merchant can just barge in. That's not good business. Stop roleplaying. What? Is this really the new thing you've been roleplaying as? Just come inside. No, can do. She'll have to come out and buy something. I'll let her know, but she doesn't like being outside though. Oh, that's too bad. Then I really want... Then I really wanted to meet her again. Uh-huh. Oh well, this means you won't have to compete with anyone. <laughs> what? I'm ecstatic. <laughs> uh-huh. After looking through your shop, I thought of some things. One, you have a pretty small selection. Will there be more? Yep, definitely. Two, are these even legal? <laughs> You're questioning legality in this kind of situation, really? Hey, those are very weird questions. My selection is massive, and on top of that, everything here is legal. Everything is legal in no man's land like this, though. <laughs> yep. <laughs> That's the point. I guess I can argue with that. Uh-huh. MC, you always like, feel like you are still in your angsty phase, but something seems a bit different about you lately. What happened exactly? I've never been angsty, and because of that, I don't need to answer this question. Weren't you telling me about some story you were writing about a month ago? There was some part where the main character got a shadow form, and his eye glowed red, and... <laughs> That's all in the past. I changed the script. Okay. Oh, okay. What do you... What, what do you change it into? His eyes glow blue instead. Oh, wow. Sans. Oh. Okay, that's all the dialogue from Lucky for now, I guess. I, I'm not sure will there be other dialogue as we progress, but we'll just see. I'm just gonna explore around. Front door? What do you mean front door? Here? Goodbye. I'm not sure I want to fight you. Here? Whoa, what the fuck? That is fucking scary. Ready when you are, MC. Re ready what? Oh, oh, you're following, what? No, what is this? I cannot accept you, that's a good thing. You know. Look at that, what the fuck happened here? I'm not sure if you noticed, but there's some sort of trap above your front door. Trap? Yeah, I noticed, I'm surprised it doesn't do anything. Oh yeah, that's a thing. I think it was keeping you from leaving, so I threw a rock at it. <laughs> wow. Oh, I guess that worked then. Thanks, Lucky. You- that's a trap? Interesting. What is all this? Who put a trap in front of your door? No, there's nothing- uh, I'm just checking around. No, don't go, dog! Doggy! <laughs> don't run away. What the hell? I can't seem to remember what this house was for. This is definitely our neighborhood, but... Do you recall anything about it, MC? Nope, as far as I remember, our house used to be right next to each other. Seems empty, though. Can't really get much out of that. Oh, well, I guess that's another thing on the list of unanswered questions here. Definitely. Whoa, what happened to this house? Yep, that's my house. As you can see, it's in garbage condition. Thanks, guys. <laughs> well, it's not uh, that much worse like MC's house and we cannot find a key. Yo, what the fuck? What the fuck happens here? Look at these things, the eyes, that thing, the mouth. Oh, shit. Look at these things. I hate it all. I love it. Oh, yeah, this thing. You ever seen anything like this before? I still can't tell what the hell it is. Maybe a bit, but I'm not really an expert either. So it looks like, like a mess to me. What? What kills it? Uh, just staring at it for more than five minutes. Sec five seconds is giving me a headache. Let's move on. Headache? Like this thing, right? No? Okay, that's nothing. I thought it will do something. No, pick that up. Thank you. Brandis, help wanted. Oh! Well, a, a shop. Are you an enemy because... Okay, because you're red. Usually red are enemy. New character! All, all creatures are welcome. What's... What's the meaning of, you know, red and gray? I have this substance of red. Will this do anything? Okay, I think I give that, give that to them. Alright, hello, who are you? What is this place? Hmm. Uh-huh. Another person, aren't you glad? 
Human customers, huh? Now, what are you two doing all the way out here? Oh, wait, you know. That's what we should be asking you, lady. We were both born in this town. So you're not human. Weird, I've never seen you around here before things got crazy even. Interesting. I think I've seen you on TV, TV. Brandy, right? That one person who has dark troubles. Oh, the TV! What? <laughs> hey, now, that was just a scripted thing. We get along perfectly fine. Oh, lady, I can't get along with animals either for some reason, so I can relate. S stop spreading misinformation by doing or something. <laughs> sure thing, my name is MC, by the way. Lucky, that's my name. Cute names, I almost forgot, but can you show me your IDs? Oh, for the drink. Let's see here. You two are way older than you look. I have a feeling that this world gets destroyed like this and people are just living like this, but suddenly Lucky's and MC's host get teleported to the future, which is, this is the future right now. Interesting. You look pretty young too. How old are you? What's important is that I can serve, drink, serve and drink this stuff. Ready to order something? <laughs> wow, okay. <laughs> sure, sure, sure. Is it okay if I dress the elephant in the room real quick? Sure, go for it. Why are there a bunch of monsters just hanging out here? Aren't you scared or, or anything? They're good guys, I don't see why I worry. R really? Have they ever attacked you? Nope, not even once. Huh? I see you have some issues with pets yourself, MC. <laughs> pets? Uh, is that what you call these damn things? <laughs> In her defense, they usually leave me alone too. I wonder why you have such a hard time with them. Probably because MC meets the hostile one. I don't really know. I mean, there's the non-hostile one back then, we see a lot of them. Those, like, grass thing. Oh, I forgot to mention, love the hair, Lucky. Oh, your, yours look great too. They both can look kind of similar now that I think about it. Yep, twin tails. <laughs> MC, what do you think with- what do you do with her hair? Me, uh, I just leave it be, it's nothing- not anything fancy. It's got some hair to look to it, so I thought it was some propose. <laughs> <laughs> You're sounding like my mom. Really? Should I start calling you sweetie from now on? Hmm. Okay, no, that won't be necessary. <laughs> okay, that's all the dialogue for now. Interesting. I will still need to show items to all of the people here. But for now, let's go. How do I go? Wait. Okay, there we, there we go. Fascinating. Oh god, what what's safe? This safe place looks like a face, by the way. This also looks like a face with hair. And it's much more larger. But the tree is still larger back then. I remember there's a, like a tree or something. We cannot advance. Oh! I cannot run out of things to talk about. Not exactly how you remember home, huh? Not really. You seem to have been handling this pretty well. I've been expecting this the entire time, honestly. <laughs> There's no point in thinking about it. This is our life for now. For now. It will get better. I'll figure something out. How many times are you gonna keep saying that? Barrel's probably worried sick. I know. Aw. Why there's a safe point when there's nothing that we can do? Or perhaps... No? Alright then. Oh, that thing is here. Wait, let me... Oh, I cannot save. Well, let's try it then. Something different? No. Only this? Infinite death thing? I wonder if we can actually pass it if we have enough health. Because it decreases our health, you know? This is like the infinite passage time room. And that's the safe point, I just realized it. And that's us? And- oh, we return here without- uh, without Lucky. That is interesting. We can do that, actually, huh? <laughs> There's no Lucky! Well, that's a bug. Alright then. Interesting. I need to tell the developer about that. By the way, I forget to mention how creepy the sound is. Oh. <laughs> Good fucking dude, Lucky, you scared me! <laughs> wow. <laughs> Well, anyway, yeah, let's go back inside. For now, let's start the exploration, shall we? Or maybe not, I want to end the video right here because it's been a long, quite a long episode.
So I guess that's all for Precious Star for now, mostly dialogues. Of course, there will be more dialogues because I'm gonna explore items that I found. But that's later. For now, let's end it. So I guess that's all for Precious Star. I hope you enjoy it. See you later then in the next episode. Bye-bye.